Good day folks, today in this quick little video I'm going to show you how to connect your DJI goggles to your Mavic 2 Pro. Now it doesn't matter whether you have the original goggles, the white ones, or the racing edition, which is what I have here, or whether you have the Mavic 2 Pro or the Mavic 2 Zoom, all are compatible. So let's get started. So when DJI announced the Mavic 2 series drones, they did state that yes, the goggles will be compatible. However, there will be a firmware update that needs to be installed and it was not gonna be available until the end of August. Well, today is September 4th and uh, they finally released the update. So that's not too bad, a few days off. So whether you already own the goggles and you just wanna make them compatible with the Mavic 2 or you bought the kit, maybe you bought the kit that DJI is selling with the Mavic 2 and the goggles, follow along and we will go through all the steps needed to get them synced together. Now the first thing we're going to need to do is update the firmware on the goggles that DJI released earlier today. And to do that we're going to need a computer, a PC or a Mac, and uh, what we're going to do is plug the goggles into the computer and download the updated firmware via DJI Assistant. So let's uh, go ahead and we will do that now. So the first thing we're going to do is power up our DJI goggles. We're then going to take the cable that came with the goggles, the micro USB cable, and we are going to plug it into the charging data port on the side there. So we have one side in the goggles. Now we're going to plug the other side into the computer. Now at this point, it's a good idea to wait till the computer has recognized the goggles. You'll know it's recognized it when you hear a beep, and also it will appear in your computer as a USB drive. So once we have everything plugged in, we're going to launch our DJI Assistant 2 app. It's a good idea also to make sure you're running the latest version of DJI Assistant. So I'm going to go ahead and launch the DJI Assistant. Give it permission. Now at this point, you need to make sure you're logged in. If you don't have an account with DJI, you can create one here. So right away, once you're logged in, you're going to notice that the DJI goggles are listed. So we're just going to click on them. And what it's going to do is check the current firmware that's already installed on your goggles and present you with current firmware that is available. So as you can see here at the top, it says latest version. And that's the version we want. It's the end of it is dot zero six zero zero. And uh, that's the one, according to the DJI website, that we need to make uh, the goggles compatible with the Mavic 2 Pro and the Mavic 2 Zoom. So all we're going to do is click on upgrade and we're going to hit start update and we're just going to let it do its thing. It could take anywhere from a minute to five minutes. I'm not quite sure, but I'll go ahead and pause the video while it does its thing. So as you can see here, we got a notification that the update has completed. So now let's go ahead and we will unplug it and we will connect the goggles to the aircraft. So to start the linking procedure, basically we're going to go into the settings and initiate a linking. And I don't know if you can see that in there, but basically you're going to go to tools, link settings, and then you got to select the Mavic 2. The Mavic 2 now appears after the firmware update. So we're going to select Mavic 2, hit confirm. Now it gives us a little thing on the page. It says make sure that the aircraft is linked to a remote. And then it says to press the linking button on the back of the aircraft, which is that one right there. So we'll set that down. Just like that, everything linked, nice and simple. And as you can see there, I don't know if you can uh, get a good view of that or not, but everything is linked up and it's transmitting in 1080 HD. So that is really nice. So if you're updating to the Mavic 2 Pro or the Mavic 2 Zoom from something like say the Spark or even the Mavic Air, you're gonna notice a huge difference and a really more enjoyable experience with the OcuSync transmission, OcuSync 2.0, I should say, with the new Mavics. Uh, a lot clearer, less uh, breakup in the screen. And not only that, you can have it on two screens. So as you can see here, I'm still connected via the DJI Go 4 app, but I'm also connected inside the goggles. And that's really nice because with the Spark and the uh, Mavic Air, you could only have one screen active at a time. So that was kind of a pain using those drones. Of course, the Mavic, the original Mavic, uh, was able to do this as well. So that's it, folks. That's how you connect your DJI goggles to the DJI Mavic 2 series. Hopefully you found this video useful. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any of our upcoming videos. And we'll see you in the next one.